Good afternoon. I just want to uh, thank all of you for being here today because this is really uh, truly an opportunity to recognize and honor you and also all those that worked for you in the face of uh, Hurricane Irma. You know, the efforts of our over 400 people that sheltered somewhere in the neighborhood, about 24,000 of the citizens of, of Lee County, they could not have done it without your efforts, obviously. But what you did not only made waves all over this community, but all made its way all the way up to Washington, D.C. And, and Congressman Rooney. And I'm absolutely honored to have you here, sir. Um, so I just, at this time, thank you so much for being here. And I'd like to turn it over to you to address this wonderful group. Thank you, Dr. Atkins. <laughs> I think we ought to thank Dr. A Dr. Atkins. I'm just glad he's here. I, Kathleen and I knew he was the real deal that first morning last August when he was out there in the dark load, helping load those school buses. I thought, this guy, you know, is the real deal. But, uh, and it's just really great for me to be able to thank you all for what you did. It was amazing to see the community come together so fast, so organized. I mean, like you said, Dr. Atkins, principals know how to organize large groups of people, and you certainly showed that you could. And I happened to get by the Dunbar shelter. It was the only one in Lee County I got by. I got by some of the other ones in Collier. But uh, you saved a lot of people from a lot of misery, probably saved some people from some serious harm. And I'm just personally glad to be your representative and to work with such good people, and, and thank you. I also want to thank Leoma in Absentia. She's such a good community leader. I don't know how many of you all do. Everybody know Leoma Lovegrove out at Matt Lachey? She's called and said, I'm going to paint a dozen of these things. And so I said, well, I'll tell you what, she was, going to, she was going to sell them, like, you know, offer them for sale in her store. I said, I'll tell you what, I'll buy them all and I'll give, give some of them away and so that you can make one, uh, one check to the Red Cross. And that's what I think she did here this week. So we're giving one to the police and one to the uh, Golisano Children's uh, Museum or sorry, hospital and to you all. And, and then a couple of other people we know that rode out the hurricane and had severe damages to their house and stuff like that. So thank you again for all you've done. Thank you for letting me come visit with you today. And uh, let's just hope we don't have another arm anytime soon. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 